right, so we're going to work on the go forward cue. And um, we've already gotten the horse to walk off using the hip, moving the hip in sequence until the horse steps off. And then we have the horse giving and going. So now we're going to add the leg cue. Or I would, um, if you're going to use a cluck or a kiss, we'll do that first. And what you'll do is um, make sure that the horse is used to that noise from the ground. And as the horse is walking, you're going to add it. So um, for leg, you start bump, 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 bump. Let the horse walk. Then stop the horse. Then ask the horse again to move with the bridle. And each time you're going to add the bump of the leg a little bit sooner. So there's three, four, five, bump, bump, bump. Let the horse walk another five, six, seven, vary the amount of time so the horse doesn't start um, associating it with stopping. Then you ask the horse to move again with the bridle. One, two, three, four, add the leg. Then stop the horse. Ask the horse to move again with the bridle. One, two, three, add the leg. Then stop the horse. Back over. And ask the horse to go forward. One, two, three, bump, bump, bump. Let the horse walk. Ask the horse to stop. Ask the horse to move with the bridle. One, two, bump, bump, bump. Let the horse walk. Stop the horse with the bridle. Now he's done enough of the stopping exercises that he's going right into the stop. So if your horse keeps walking through the bridle, you're going to move the hip over, stop him like you've done with the um, disengaging the hip to get to the stop. Ask him to walk forward again. One step, bump, bump, bump. Let the horse walk. Stop him with the bridle. Ask him to walk with the bridle again. One step, bump, bump, bump. Let him walk. Ask him to stop. And this time we're going to ask at the same time. So I'm going to pick up on the bridle and bump at the same time. And that's the first time I've put the two together. Let him walk. And again, you'll stay at each one. If your horse shows any adverse reactions, then just stay at the, at the, the previous step until the horse gets it. So now I'm going to ask him with just the bump. Right? And hopefully that's exactly what happens is the horse walks off. Now, if the horse doesn't walk off when you add the leg by itself, then you will back it up with your rein while your leg is bumping. As soon as the horse starts walking, you take the leg off. If you're going to use a kiss, then you want to do the same thing. You want to ask the horse to go with your leg or with the hip, I mean the bridle. Let him go and then kiss. Let the horse keep walking. Then stop him with the bridle. And you'll back that all the way down until so you're asking the horse, asking the horse, one, two, three, four, kiss. Let the horse keep walking. And then stop him with the bridle again. Ask him to move forward. One, two, three, four, kiss. Let the horse keep walking. And stop him with the bridle. And back it up till you get the same thing. You, while you, um, um, I'm sorry, you ask him to, uh, hang on, let's come around here again. Ask him at the same time that you pick up on the bridle and ask him to step off. Again, if, if you want to use this sound, you want to introduce it to him from the ground first. Uh, work on it from the ground first so he doesn't get upset by it, especially if your horse is sensitive to um, noise. Ask him to stop. If he doesn't stop, pick up the hip and stop him. Then ask him with just the kiss and have him walk off. 
there are pre cues that you can put in the performance too. Um, you can uh, think. You're going to think forward, and then you can move your bridle rein up, then lean forward. Okay, and if you're going to use your leg, start the leg that way. This way it gives the horse a couple of pre cues. Same thing. You can um, lean forward and kiss, and that gives the horse some pre cues to your go forward cue as well. But just make sure that you get a physical cue on him so that if you need to back it up, if he refuses your um, verbal cue, you can back it up with a leg cue. If he refuses the leg cue, you can back it up with the bridle. And you'll practice that until the horse moves off your leg and your um, verbal consistently. And then we'll move on to um, the next part.